Thank you, game. Thank you. Thank you for sending me down. I would like to get down. Here at Aperture, we're always trying to push the boundaries of science that little bit more. That's why we're taking on this new project. God. When the bean counters told me not to buy a salt mine and all this science, the first thing they said was, No, there's too much space. You can't suspend something over nothing and pray that a test can happen in thin air. Well, thanks to some use of the old calculator between the ears and a generous helping of the You're Fired stamp, I came up with a final solution to that. If you can't anchor something in thin air, why bother trying to make it in the air in the first place? I came up with this. Are we going to get... Aww. Introducing the Aperture Science Innovator's Suspended Testing Sphere. Each sphere is suspended in the air, anchored to the walls by concrete and steel lattice rebar. They seem like they float in the air, but in fact, they don't. Plus, we can keep building above them, onward and upward. This salt mine here can take at least 10 of these bad boys per shaft. Nine shafts, 90 tests. We can test whatever we want to and beat that other company into the ground. Black Mason. Those guys can kiss my... Anyway, the bean counters cried like babies when they saw the cost of these things. But they wet their pants when they threw them out the door. I pay the bills, I make the decisions around here, but I hire and fire as I please. Now, this is how they should have done it. Now, the first of these spheres won't be ready for a few more months, so you'll be participating in one of our smaller tests, the Aperture Science Innovator's Short-Term Relaxation Vault. Oh. Oh, dear. Wait, we know what that involves. No, I don't want to go in any bloody room where I sleep for 20 million years, because that's what I'll end up doing. Up sleeping for 20 million years and then I'll be broken down to dust. I tend to do a vegetable. I don't want to be apple. I don't want to be chill. I'm happy being me. Whoever me is. Um, but anyway, yeah, this is how I reckon a portal, portal, portal prequel would go happen around. This is what it would look like. You'd have people that actually move around. You'd have characters you need to know other than yourself. Human characters, not just, not just a boy. When you get to the offices, I'll tell you a bit more. This okay. test should be real easy for you, though. Just get inside one of the Aperture Science Innovator's short-term relaxation vaults and lie in a bed. You'll feel yourself fall asleep quickly. Don't worry, though. Our science boys will get you out shortly. You'll only be out for a few minutes. Uh, an hour, at most, if something goes wrong. <coughs> Don't worry. We've got everything under control. You'll be making science, and you won't have to do a thing. Who's the winner here? You are. Yeah, I don't feel like the winner, Cave. Just, just out of notice. I do not feel like the winner when you say the words an hour at most. I definitely feel a plot twist coming along. <laughs> I really like to stay here, though. This is a nice place. I like 1950s Aperture. It's a really nice place, and people look like they come from City 17, which is quite concerning when it comes to this game. Okay, we're coming into land, and we're going to get another loading screen, aren't we? Yes, of course we are. Of course we're going to get another loading screen. Okay, this is another different loading. Why did you give me the same loading screen game? Why? Okay, um, we still haven't hit a test yet. Ooh, it's a bit dark. So, as I said on the last pre-recorded message, you'll be heading into an Aperture Science Innovator's short-term relaxation oh. vault for a quick deep sleep, and then you're done. That's why we brought you here at night. You're most likely a walking zombie. That'll give us the best results. But just remember, don't sleep too long. This isn't a bed and breakfast. And if you decide to stay the night, I'm charging you rent for the next year. <laughs> we have a bed ready for you. Just follow the testing area signs and go to bed. Let's kill don't myself. The turrets. They're firing legs. <laughs> oh, I wondered if it was... So does that mean that the water in... Um... Portal is only toxic? Because of so, as I said on is the last pre-recorded message, you'll be heading into an Aperture Science Innovator's so short-term so relaxation it's vault it's for a quick, deep sleep, then and then you're done. That's why we brought you here at night. You're most likely a walking zombie. Mm. That'll give us the best results. But just remember, don't sleep too long. This isn't a bed and breakfast. And if you decide to stay the night, I'm charging you rent for the next year. We'll have a bed ready for you. Just follow the testing area signs and go to bed. Don't mind the turrets. They're firing blanks. At least that's what Crazy Harry told me. <clears throat> Got six signs, boys. Disappear, because of <laughs> That's a ridiculous game. Go on. Come on, Cave. You can't just do that. You're mad. I know you're mad, but you can't do that. 
this is a relaxation vault. Wait, so they've um wait, those are other tests, aren't they? Surely. Yeah, I don't understand why they fill this place with very, very acidic shit. Normally. I would assume that was I thought that came from the beam. Oh, you're a turret! Oh! So this is... Inhalation hazard. I assume this is what they're pumping into me. The inalienable right of children to something sweet. So what are you gonna draw? Interesting. Uh, what's this way then? Why are the toilets always out of service? Uh, just a load of typewriters, I'd assume. Some messy people. No allergens. Um, I assume Cave sits here on his cave chair. Let's go and sit on Cave's chair. Giggle. Giggle at the game. I am in Cave's chair. I am all powerful. Ah. And the game has suddenly hit 30 FPS. Why? I will not know. I'll never know how this game works. I'll we'll never know how the FPS works. I'll probably more later on this. So what's upstairs? Can I go upstairs? Oh, I can. Ooh. I'm going to explore the crap out of this. Because I can. And because I shall. And because I want to get my free money's worth out of it. Okay, so best new science company in 1947. I assume Black Mesa hit the stage around that point. Um, so we've got more bloody um, things. Caution, fire door, do not block. This is most certainly blocked, gentlemen. Nice work, science. Jarrett's Jarrett's, etc, etc. <laughs> now, people people like like this game. I do, I have a tendency to love it as well. There's nothing to do there either. Okay, so, I do love this game. It's a brilliant game. I like Portal. It's got a good storyline. It's not the best, but it's average. Uh, let's see where we're going now. Somewhere over here. Let's have a look. Oh, through here. Okay. More moon crap. Why are these moon? Don't worry. Those toys won't kill you. The safety on their guns is on. Had some lab boys shut them down. Crazy Harry likes me. Yeah, your turrets. Um, what's this? Spirit of Idaho. National Potato Board for the promotion of potato science. Yes. Potato science. Truly one of the greatest dogs. Hello. Oh, why don't you turn around? Oh, I'll help. Hello. No, you're not going to do anything. Oh, okay. Remote activated door. Wait for attendant. That wasn't very remote activated. Oh. Oh God. Um, I'm going to look around here first before you stick me in a box. Is there any? Little giggles in the holes. So, because I really like that. Just a potato at the end of one of that was just for the freaking hell of it. Come on, I know you're a game, but you gotta have some humor somewhere. No, nothing. Really. Short term realization vault. Okay. Let's get in. If you're hearing this message, you're at the sleeping chamber. Carolyn, this is test ready. Yes, sir, Mr. Johnson. Then you're good to go. Step into the chamber and get into the bed. Our lab boys will take care of the rest. I don't trust this, but okay, let's go. Right, ah, lovely bed. Mmm, mmm, sleepy. Mm, yes. Oh. Good night, everybody. Ooh, I've got fingernails. Okay, that's interesting. Good night. Night, night. Currently recording this at, um... 10 o'clock, so technically... Oh, I know. Sleepy. Mm -hmm. Cheap. Mm -hmm. Rhinos everywhere. Why is there an elephant in the room? Mm. Oh... God, what's gone on? What the... Oh, God. 
The Terminator, he's coming back for us. I knew it would happen. Genesis all over again. Wait. How did I not wake up from that? Blaring alarms. They have humans. You know, this is this is why this is why Aperture Science never ever got on. This is why Aperture Science was always second best, because they took a human, put them into resources that were assets, and left them there to rot. Oh god, whoa, is whoa. A, is is this thing on? Hello? Hello? Can you hear me? Oh, right, you can't answer. <clears throat> I'm so sorry, astronaut, Olympian, or war hero. There was a slight problem with the test. Don't worry though, we got shot okay. Nothing's different, nothing's changed. Just uh, head out of the chamber, I'll tell you a bit more out there. Oh god, the do What did you do, Cave? Don't worry about the heights. Had a few of my scientists make what's called long fall boots. Uh, I mean, aperture science innovators, long fall boots. <laughs> that was easier to think of than I thought. Okay. Oh, that's lucky. Oh yeah, I've got the long food boots on. Okay, so um, how the bloody, how the bloody hell did I get stuck in all this mess? Pick that yellow device up. Don't worry, it's not hazardous. I've had the scientists leave you a new device to help you. Yeah, that's right. A new test. Congratulations! You get to test something else now. Double the experiments for you. Oh, a gun. Okay, I got the gun. Oh, what's this? Oh, it's an aperture science hand on portal device. Oh, this one shines. It's made out of a staple. There's an open door nearby. Should take you out of the building. You'll need that new test to move around. But don't worry though, we built the building like this. Yeah, sure. Uh, don't worry about that. It's just uh, a new drilling test we're doing down below, yeah, <laughs> to get the salt mines deeper, to get more testing spheres in, yeah, yeah, that's it. Just ignore that. Why don't I believe you? Why, why do I have a hard time believing anything you said? Okay, we're going up there immediately, okay? Okay, you're not plywood portable, but you are. What's the difference? Are you like plywood? Because that's cheating. You can't make something look like plywood. An OSA inspector. Department of N. Okay, what have you done? Oh god, I'm gonna die now. Let's <laughs> put one to go then. Get out again. Right, so, um, portal start. Don't mind all this too. We just had uh, earthquakes. Lots of earthquakes. Yeah, yeah, you get lots of those here in Michigan. <gasps> Was that the original design for the turret? Oh, that's beautiful. I love it. Oh, God. Where the science is theoretical, but your $60 is fact. Okay, so this is clearly after Cave Johnson sold the place off to make room for fucking everything else. Uh, jump to the floor. These earthquakes uh, even shook up time a bit. Some stuff from the future got here. Yeah, that's how it's here. Uh, don't worry, it's still 1952. Adlai Stevenson is still president. Alright, so, the earthquakes. Kinda did some redecorating in here. Destroy the door too. You'll have to find another way out. Oh god, that was not safety! Oh shit! Neither are you, I assume. Ow, 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 fuck. Um, need to find a new way out. Um, well, I've got a bit of bubble water at the surface there. Upstairs, another portal upstairs. That should work. Be well, there's got to be something you can use to launch yourself over the door. There has to be another way out. What was this? I don't know what I'm going to use this for, but there's no way to jump down there. It's not even the first test and I'm having a migraine! Damn you, game! Oh! 
Well, that makes sense now. Fuck you. You know what? You know what? No, no, no. No, no, no. Do you want another word I'm going to use for you? Fuck you. I'm going to use that word all over your face right now. Because that was beautiful. Oh! Okay, um, I assume that's how you... Okay, I'm getting a couple of glass of... Ah, hey! Oh dear, I, I, I broke something. I know, things might look different than what you're used to, but uh, while you were spending that little time sleeping, we had some... some uh, aperture science nanomachines come in and build all this stuff. Yeah, yeah, that's it. They're quick little guys. Faster than any science guy I got. I can sense almost immediately that that is bullshit. And, oh, oh, okay, so they built a, wait, so GLaDOS built a gel flow through the middle. So GLaDOS built a gel flow through the middle of, um, the old Aperture Science pack, because she wanted the gel upstairs. Over. That's blue gel, it should still be usable. Blue gel, don't give me that bullshit game. And I would prefer it if you didn't fluctuate in FPS from 36 to 58. Alright, so we're ending the bit that says 1959 on Beyond that door is one of the new testing tracks. Totally, completely new. Get through it and head to the first testing sphere. I'll let you know more there. Now, I just want to make sure you know something before you go any further. We have these new inventions called emancipation grids in place to prevent objects from moving around to other tests. Now some guy decided that it would be a good idea to make ones that prevent people from going through. And installed one where people needed to go through. Yeah, okay, I can see where this is going almost immediately. Um, you're gonna do this to me, aren't you? <laughs> Yay! Exactly what I wanted to see. Good work, game. Nice work. Um. Okay, so let's go in here and have a look. Around. 